We are in the world of Dal Solala, I mean Dal Sol Valley. The world where Sims aspire to big dreams. The world of the rich and the famous. The world where many Sims wish they could live. But it's also the world where this monstrosity exists. And because this mansion is a total pain in my pancreas, I decided to transform this house into something worse. <laughs> okay, that was cringy, I'm so sorry. Yes, people, today we are gonna be transforming this hideous, what Judy over here calls her gorgeous mansion. You know, I was actually planning on making this mansion look prettier, and the camera doesn't want to work with me, but it's alright. But you know, because I hate Judith Ward so much, I decided to make this mansion even more hideous than it already is. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. First, we're gonna need some money over here. We might need, I don't know, a lot. Because Judith doesn't have a lot, so we're gonna give her a lot. So the first thing I really wanted to change about this house is the exterior. Because the exterior is the most horrifying part of this house. You know, I was thinking, you know, maybe we could add something over here like this. Okay, let's get this octagonal room. One like this over here. Copy and paste that. Put it on the top. W what did I just do? Oh, I just moved it. Dumbass. All right, we're gonna copy and paste this. Put it on here. And then we're gonna take another one. And you know, just put it here in the middle of the roof. Oh my god, copy and paste that. Oh, wait, can't place walls or rooms above the fourth floor? Are you kidding me? Well, um, obviously not. Oh well, so we'll just work with the one that we have over here. Oh my god, that is very off key, but you know, that's kind of the idea, and I'm not sorry about it. Why don't you want to extend? Like, what? What is your? Pr what is your problem? Are you? What the F? Alright, you know what, I'm just gonna move this to there. Oh my god, what, 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 what's happening? This game doesn't want to allow me to screw up her house. But you know what, we'll just keep it as it is. It's beautiful, it's gorgeous, alright? We're gonna take this roof, we're gonna take it a little bit down. It doesn't, it doesn't wanna... You know, I think I just broke my freaking game by doing nothing, basically. Oh well, you know, we'll just restart, you know, that might fix things, you know, EA, please fix your freaking game. We pay a lot of money to play your game and you're you're doing this to us. And that's your response? Are you serious? <laughs> what an insult, you know, to your Sims players, to your loyal community. Alright, my lovely peeps, as you can see, I had to totally restart, which means I lost all my progress, all of my beautiful progress, but you know what, that is alright, we're gonna be doing Doing something better. Okay, we're gonna take this, make it a little bit bigger. Take no, no, no. Copy and paste it. Put it on top of there. Copy and paste this mother and put it on this side over here. Now we're gonna get a roof that will fit onto this monstrosity. Bring out the overhangs a little bit. Whoop. Everything is so white, I can barely see what's happening. Where's the little, where's the other little thingy? The, 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 yeah. The thingy that, yeah, whatever. I'll just copy and paste this ugly thing over here, put it over here, like so. So we have a piece of wool sticking through there, but you know what? That's the beauty of it, all right? Trust the freaking process. We have another roof going over here, going up like that, and like so. And we're gonna copy and paste that and put it on this side. You know, I'm afraid I'm actually starting to make this house look better than it did before you know put on some ugly trims over here wait no let's go for the pink trims of course you know because judy is a bit full of herself okay that makes no sense whatsoever but we're gonna take this roof down to its lowest and this roof down to its lowest and maybe we're gonna extend it a little bit to the sides oh my gosh this is gorgeous we're gonna take it to the very back which is gonna take away some windows but that is all right we're gonna curve this roof a little bit oh can we can we curve this roof of course we can curve it. Oh yeah, there we go. Ah, this is looking gorgeous so far, people. Gorgeous. I think and I feel like we need another roof over here. Yeah, give me the chunky roof trims. Yes. Oh my gosh. I would like to give her a beautiful pink roof color as well. Like, oh my gosh. That is just sensual. Ah, uh, somehow. All right. So let's go over to, well, of course, the love struck pack. I just feel like we could use some beautiful wall prints over here. How about these roses? Oh my God, these roses. Uh, how about these vines? How about the crocodile skin? How about this? No, that's too pretty. That's too cute. No. We're gonna gonna go in for some flowers over here oh my god this is looking beautiful i'm pretty sure judith is gonna love her new transformation
animation. I'm enjoying this way too much. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I learned something new. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god, I shouldn't be laughing like that. That was just maniacal on another level and I shouldn't need to well explain. Yeah, you know what? This is not a child-friendly channel. Let's do this copy and paste these gorgeous pillars or columns whatever we want to call them that one is not in the middle but that is all right all right oh we got some lovely yellow windows from love struck we can place a few of them here in the front we can have some of these windows on the sides wait take away the old windows they suck okay okay whoa 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 judith why do you have these awnings like that does not make any sense for such a gorgeous boat like what you're out of your gosh dang mind oh we missed the wall beautiful oh my gosh the foundation the freaking foundation could get a change i think let's make it nice and high you know judith wants to be seen oh yeah you know those columns kind of look like stockings i love it <laughs> or leggings you know striped leggings anyway we can have some of these lovely neon staircases oh, okay wait, wait yeah there we go some over there oh do we have any stairs at the back no i could have sworn we had stairs at the back why is it so freaking freaking bright so we have some beautiful stilts for a foundation oh my gosh okay you know what the stilts is a little bit obnoxious it's a little bit too obnoxious for this house all right so uh maybe we'll just go with plain stone Ooh, yeah bring it to me this looks so good judith is gonna kiss my fate when she sees her new transformation let's get rid of these ugly gosh dang windows i don't want them on my property and these awful awnings oh my god god do not like them one bit now just look at the beautiful placement of these windows you know like they're extremely off key but you know it's a new thing people are into that kind of things you know the rich people nowadays are into weird shit so that's exactly what we're doing we're gonna make everything super weird and a girl is thinking about drums. Okay, that's interesting. Why have one door when you can have four? We can get some of these beautiful blue windows at the front here as well. We can have some of these adorable things at the... What? Ass wipe. All right. We can have some of these adorable things at the... Oh my god. All right. We can have some of these cute things at the front, you know? As a gorgeous entrance. <gasps> butterflies we can have some gorgeous butterflies over here oh my god isn't that gorgeous oh my god we can have some gnomes oh i'm just gonna grab anything that i see that interests me <gasps> the hippo the massive ass hippo over here get away tree we are not into nature we're rich so we are into creepy ass shit okay i'm just kidding all right, I'm just kidding about that. But anyway, how can we forget about the flamingos? Oh my god, we can have some noise of flamingos over here. <gasps> this is a masterpiece. Uh, these things are hideous. We can replace those with something much better, I feel. Look at that, we have a beautiful bell bell yeah love bell of tortoise on top of the roof don't you think that's gorgeous oh yeah and you know what we cannot forget about some gorgeous spray paints i'm gonna take my favorite spray paint <laughs> i'm gonna take my favorite spray paint and just do random shit all right all right there we go we cannot afford the trees because they drop leaves and it doesn't look right, you know. But you know what? I still would like to add a tree. I just I just want to find something better than what we had. Wait, this isn't... They're out of season? All right, fine. We can have a bigger purple tree. You know what? You know, that's fine. We can have it here at the back by the flamingos. You know what? I'm, I'm going to stop... <laughs> no i'm not gonna stop with the exterior just hold on a second just hold on a second i got the perfect thing for this house the perfect thing whalebert yes queen i would love you on there oh so cute so cute oh you know the lighting is so bright at the back oh my god there's the little whalebert over there <laughs> The zooming out, oh my god, all right. What else can we add to the beautiful exterior? How about a little, can I make this bigger? Yeah, I can, gorgeous. She has a massive uh, hot tub, there we go. It's a birthday hot tub, by the way. It comes with base game, if you guys didn't know that, you do now. Look at this beautiful hot tub, she has hot tubs everywhere. And you know the flamingos, they stand in the hot tub. She bought 
hot tubs or she got them installed just so that her flamingos can stand in some water. You see? How fancy is that? It's extremely fancy. Oh, we got some mushrooms over here. I oh, know it's not mushrooms, but, but just let me have at it. All right. We have gorgeous yellow mushrooms. Oh my gosh. I don't think there's anything else I can add more to this house to make it look even more beautiful. She stole this. This thing, you know, she stole it from Mount Komorobi, the freaking witch that she is. Well, not from Mount Komorobi, but from Forent, you know, the world. Tartosa. No, not that. God. I always forget the names of the worlds. And oh my god, we need a little patchy as well. Patchy is such a great help in a garden, but we don't have a garden. So, you know, patchy, you're gonna be sitting there forever, buddy. Let's move on to the insides of this house, all right? We can have some beautiful. Ooh, this is gorgeous. That is absolutely amaze balls going down to the first floor i'm sorry judy but we're gonna f it up no we're not no we're not we're gonna make it look pretty we're gonna make it beautiful let's take away all of these hideous curtains oh my god take away everything you know i'm just i'm just gonna take away everything that this house has to offer and you know a piano cannot be your centerpiece milady and definitely not this alone standing violin over there i'm sorry judy but you you deserve better all right i have the best item for a centerpiece perfect <laughs> we got a beautiful throne in the middle of the room hey judy just don't try to use it you're gonna fall inside <laughs> cool. should we make it a little bit bigger yes and we need the most fanciest rug underneath this throne. Oh, yeah. Okay. No love struck. I want you to come back. Okay, no, you know what? This is too fancy. I'm so sorry. No, we cannot go with that. But we shall go with the leopard print. You know, she's into the leopard print. So we're gonna do that. And then we got some cow print over here. Because she is a cow. Some vines over here, here, and there. I'm getting very lazy with this. <laughs> we got some worn out, beautiful wallpaper in the kitchen oh my gosh and this kitchen really needs an upgrade honey this really needs an upgrade oh my god what were you thinking honestly what am i thinking nobody knows oh wait the floor the floor should be beautiful maybe some vines <laughs> we shall have some beautiful counters from what you calls it that pack we shall put them along here turn on auto counters you know bring it alongside here do this let it go inside like so oh yeah we got a swirly going we got a swirly going beautiful expensive ass fridge judith just loves you know making food in a microwave so we're gonna give her three of those and give her the prettiest stove that exists which is this stove over here all right <laughs> so <laughs> Jesus. So we have some more microwaves. Oh my gosh. And our girl, she really loves her muffins. Or not her muffins, you know. Um, what do we call this again? Um, um, yeah, she loves her coffee. And then we got some waffle makers. That, that's the word that I was looking for, the waffle makers. And then she has pressure cookers for Africa. And inside here, we got some beautiful cabinets very high up so that our girl can't reach it because she has no reason to reach it, you know. You know what? I think I'm going to change the wallpaper, but just give me a sec over here. I'm going to make it look beautiful. Beautiful. Yes, there we go. The beautiful, gorgeous bright and eccentric red yes all right this is gorgeous okay let's go into the next room so this is a little dining room screw that it's too cheap for her so we got some ugly grime going on along the top of the walls because judy over here is a very dirty lady literally and figuratively dirty ass lady why is this happening why is that happening so for the dining room we gotta have the best of the best we got a Christmas table, beautiful, with some beautiful rainbow dining chairs. Oh my gosh, now this is giving party vibes. Oh yeah. Oh, we got a beautiful love heart. We can have a few of those here. I'm sorry, Judy, but this is gonna be your only centerpiece for this beautiful entrance way, all right? This is beautiful and more beautiful. You cannot get than this. Oh my god. 
here by the living room we can get the best couches you know the best of the best of the freaking best all right the best which is these logs oh my gosh so naturistic although our rich people are not into the naturistic things and by our rich people i mean judith okay and only judith got some of these logs here as well oh my gosh i don't i don't even know what the f i'm doing we don't have one tv but we have thousands of tvs we got many tvs in this tv room and she's so rich her tv goes over her windows like <laughs> Who doesn't do that, you know? You know, her whole living room is a cinema. A Hollywood treasure. And then we can get a beautiful rug. Ooh, this caught my eye. I love this. Oh my god. We got some cute little rug arounds over here. You know, to tie in with the naturistic feeling. Take that shit away. Take it away. And take this shit away as well, please. What is a TV room without some lovely disco balls? We got some disco balls in the house. All right, what room is this? A useless room? Okay, I get it. So what can we do with a useless room? Take away the bathroom stuff. And why the frick do you have two bathrooms? We can we can just make this one big ass bathroom, you know? Does this woman really shit that much? Oh my God. All right, you know what? The middle part, I would like to have the white that we have in the bathroom. Yeah, that's gorgeous. All right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We still have a room to finish over here. <laughs> okay. We can do some robotics, some robotics. We can do some archaeology. We can do some chess, <laughs> which requires a beautiful chair. No, that's way too beautiful. There we go. We can have some drinks while we play chess. And uh, we can make some fizzy juice. And uh, uh, we can do some DJing, of course. Beautiful. No, that's one room finished. All right, the bathroom. I really want to get serious with this bathroom. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> and by serious, I mean none other than this. Well, ain't that beautiful? You know, a girl cannot have too many toilets, but she can only have one bath. I'm sorry. Some hand towels to wipe with. Because I'm not going to give you any toilet paper. <laughs> oh my god. This is so sick. Okay, you know what? You know what? Fine, fine, fine. I'll give you one toilet paper roll. So you decide which one you want to use in order to actually reach the toilet roll. So we have some towels. Can never have too many towels. You know, I am a person who loves to get me a lot of towels. I am towel obsessed. Oh, uh, we don't have a... a mm a sink in here we can have one of those fancy sinks one on this side and one on this side i want to give it the prettiest mirror that we have those kitty cats this needs to move now oh my god the towels are in the way <laughs> so we got some beautiful zebra print in this bedroom or room whatever this room is gonna be you know what we can make this an extra bedroom you know for guests which judith never has we have a gorgeous love bed and we have a gorgeous avocado rug yeah i i don't know if this is an avocado i see it as an avocado okay i i can't help it i just can't help it we got these lovely little curtains we got some wardrobes ca uh, count oh no dressers there we go we got some dressers so fancy we got some mirrors and we got some mass of mirrors as well some more over there all right, just look up out of all those bedroom ass. I love it so much. What is a bedroom without a massive llama? Gorgeous, massive ass llama. All right, what did we miss? Well, these parts over here were empty as hell to begin with. So we're gonna leave them empty as hell. We're just gonna change the flooring. Oh, I forgot about this part over here. You can have some lovely tile work over here. Why is your house so freaking dark, Judith? Got some lights. What's here? Nothing what's the purpose honey oh wait her staircase used to be here oh that's right oh i see what's happened my roof is screwing everything up okay let's just bring it back then we can just bring it back i didn't know this was a loft okay i'm sorry sorry judith nobody gives a shit replace these beautiful guys with something better welcome to the dungeon of hell you know we got some satans over here what, what's this rug about yeah, I can just make it red. Enter the Satan's house. Going on to the one bedroom. You know, which bedroom do you think she actually uses? This one or this one? None, I tell you. She sleeps in the basement. No, she sleeps in her non-existent money pile. 
You see, there's no money in there. Let's take this away. What's this? Oh, it's the Tavy's frame going through the roof. Now we have an empty ass room to do creepy stuff in. We can have some grass. Um, the bathroom can also have some grass, and the wardrobe can also have some grass. We can have some different grass here. We can have some vans. Oh, the vans are so fine. Take away that ugly piece of shit. We can have some container aesthetic in this house. A pink container aesthetic. I would like to use the exact same container aesthetic for the entrance way. No, it needs to be red because this is the Satan's entrance over here. Of course, we gotta get crazy with the cow print again because the cow print is everything. We can have this ugly wallpaper, whatever that is, in there. This in here. Oh, beautiful. We can have a huge resort bed. Because it's Judith. She wants everything big. And I mean everything. We can have a beautiful rug. You know. For the painter aesthetic. Not that Judith has any painting skill. I don't think she does. Nope. She does not. But she has gardening level 3. Gourmet cooking. Okay nobody, nobody cares. Nobody cares. Nobody freaking cares. We got some beautiful plants here in the bedroom. We want some beautiful hanging plants. Like so, so, and so. Oh, yeah. Walk-in closet can have some lovely plants over here. For someone who's not into nature sure does love her plants. But you know, these are fake plants. That's the thing. We got some plants against the wall. Oh my gosh, I forgot this is a bathroom. <laughs> Judith, you are gonna love the new transformation. Your eyes are actually gonna pop out of your face. From excitement, we have a beautiful fish coffee table in the middle of our walk-in closet how fancy is that you know we can have another fish coffee table but a bigger one which means it's not gonna act as a coffee table but it is gonna act as a fish tank some bassinets over here for when she decides you know to become a mom this can be her kids room oh my gosh this is gonna be gorgeous all right and then we got some cats one for each person this sucks i don't like it and the kids will definitely not like it but i will tell you what the kids will like they will like these oh yes you know i wish we had a more vibrant color in this swatch you know that would be so nice but we don't so yeah okay we can take this light copy and paste it a few times like so oh a lot of lights i love it and this side hmm what we can do on this side we can have some toy chests and the kitty's bathroom cannot be so fancy cannot be so serious oh my god oh I think our kids would like a little bit of grass, don't you think? Oh yes, they never go out to touch the grass. They have to touch the grass inside of their bedrooms. Poor things. We got some sunlight in here as well. You know, the little, you see the little suns. We got some parties galore. And we got a toilet. You only get one toilet. We're gonna give our kids a hot tub of their own. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick a nice one. They can have an onsen. Oh my god, they can have an onsen. Where am I gonna put this onsen? <gasps> I need to have an onsen somewhere over here. Good for you, Judith. But yeah, the kids over here shall have their own gosh dang hot tub. Like, ain't they lucky? Of course they are. You know, they're Judith's future kids. We can have two tubs because why not? And we can have a two-in-one shower and... Okay, and you know what? These kids are very clean, apparently. But anyway. So we got a lovely hot tub over here in the corner. I would just like to put in a little something adorable to look at while they are in the hot tub. And then, of course, we have this piece of monstrosity. Wait, 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 wait. We forgot about this room. So this room is supposed to be her secret spot where she stashes all of her weed. I mean, her money. You know, that's green, too. Alright, you know, I think I'm absolutely finished. So in this room over here, we got some barbecues going on. We got some massive unicorns, some of these amigos. But anyway, let's take a tour. But first off, we gotta embrace how beautiful this is. Just look how it shines in the sunlight. <gasps> Judith, are you happy? You have to be happy. Anyway, so let's take a beautiful tour of our beautiful new Judith Ward mansion. You know, this is so beautiful. It just takes my breath right out of my ass. I mean, my, 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 my lungs, whatever. All right, so let's go over here. So the entrance is all about the Satan's, okay? This is, this is the entrance way, whoops, to the Satan's house. What, what? 
Oh my god, I didn't... You know what? That's okay. That, that's stylish. That's stylish. That's stylish. We're gonna keep it like that. Okay, let's go down the floor. Oh, not the floor, but just like, go down with the camera. Whatever. So over here, we have the beautiful golden throne just staring dead into your soul. Really prompts one to go to the toilet, doesn't it? Over here... Oh god. Over here, we have the gorgeous new improved kitchen of judith i love the fact that she has three freaking kettles oh my gosh we got some hearts here over here we have the beautiful christmas table with the rainbow chairs oh my god the these these curtains are so in right now let's go to this side so over here we have the TV room, it's probably my favorite room in this whole house. We got some void critter carpeting, we got some disco bows, we got some... Mm, not some, but we have a many, we have many TVs. Uh, anyway, let's go through this door over here. What lies beyond this door? Whoa, oh my god, look at this. We, we got some robotics, we got some archaeology, we got some logic, we got some bows. We got some fizzy- Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> we got a DJ booth. Gorgeous. Through this door is the beautiful balcony. Oh my gosh, just look at the puzzle pieces. Like, oh my god. It's just so gorgeous. And over here we have a guest bedroom with a heart-shaped bed. And the mirror is kind of going through the bed over here. But you know, that's fine. I don't give a shit. Here we have the mess of Aslam. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, all right. Wait, wait. What? Where am I now? Oh yeah, okay. So we gotta go back to here and go up these beautiful freaking staircases. Oh my god. Alright, so over here- oh my god. Over here we have the beautiful whatever this is. Down here you can look down on the golden throne. Here we got some barbecues. Mi amigos. And there- over there is another mi amigo. Okay. And over here is um unicorns. Over here is a beautiful little play park, indoor play park for the kitties. You know, there's not much going on over here because, you know, um, this is Judith's house. It had nothing going on to begin with. Over here... What? What? Oh yeah! This is a, another guest bedroom. This is the beautiful massive heart-shaped bed. Up here is another balcony, but we don't care about balconies, do we? No, no we don't. Up here is a walk-in closet. Oh my god, just look how this looks. You know, this actually kind of looks pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Um, alright, so through this door over here is the kid's bedroom. Wow, beautiful. You know, we got three beds for three munchkins. We got three bassinets for three pooping munchkins. Over here, we got a fish tank with little fish. <laughs> over here is a hot tub for the kids. And, well, this. Through here, we have the bathroom of the kids. Like, isn't this beautiful we got four parties although we only have three kids and um over here we have a bath and shower two in one here's a bathtub and there's a bathtub okay we got some sunlight in here as well because these kids never see daylight i just quickly want to see if we have any reaction from judy over here judy what do you think honey what do you think oh my god i think it's absolutely beautiful like i i can't believe it looks so much better than what my mansion did before this is absolutely beautiful and it's an absolute disgrace to the society but you know I think it looks much better than than what I had before. Yeah, you know what Judy, I agree, I agree. What do you think about the mess of mushrooms? You know, I kind of want to get high on them but I can't because it's only decorative. Yeah, it's, it's, it's decorative, Judy. But yeah, Judy, do you want to do our outro for us today? Yeah, sure, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. And, you know, all those other stuff. But yeah, we will see you all in the next oh, one. Dad. Bye. Dad, Dad.